for a few minutes. I'm just setting up my camera and then I'm gonna skate. But. in Seattle right now and things are super different out here the streets are clear a lot of businesses are closed and there's a lot of street spots that are open right now that normally are a bust so for the next couple days I'm gonna be going across Seattle and skating spots and seeing what I could find seeing what's available during these weird times and making the most out of it disclaimer make sure that you guys are following all of the laws that are in your area it's super important to abide by these things for your own safety and for the safety of other people. I started the day out here at the Cal Anderson tennis courts just to get warmed up and skate some flat ground. Then we're gonna head deeper into the heart of the city and see what we can find out there. I'm gonna be going to spots that I already know exist, but I'm also gonna be wandering through the streets and kind of skating whatever I find. Speaking of which, there is a ledge at the end of the court here that I wanna try to ollie over. So we're gonna jump into that. pretty bad. My board's getting wet. It's kind of too wet to continue. I'm glad I got that lift slide though. So I'm gonna head home for the day. Today I kind of spent the day in Capitol Hill area. Tomorrow I'm gonna go more downtown Seattle where all the buildings are. We'll see how that goes but I'll see you tomorrow. I'm starting the day off here at the Westlake Plaza. I was gonna skate this super buttery ledge over here, but there's someone sitting on it right now. So we'll have to come back to that later, but I'm gonna skate these big ledges over here and see what we can do.
sick. So I just got some Instagram clips on that big ledge over there. And then the guy got up off this other ledge. So that's open now. And some other skaters showed up, which is nice because it's been dead out here because of the pandemic and everything. So let's see what tricks we can get on that. That session was whack. As you saw, my board shot out of that manual and it actually rolled into the street and it rolled right underneath a cop car. He kicked me out and he told me to go home. So I kind of just called it a day. Today is the next day and I'm with my homie Jake. We're at Garfield High School. There's a bunch of obstacles here that other skaters left behind. There's a rail, there's this mani pad, there's this weird metal thing, there's this cone. And obviously there's just a bunch of skate spots here in general. So we're gonna shred and see what we can get here. Let's do it. Jake's heading out now. He just stopped by for a little session. He's going to work. He works at a coffee shop in Kirkland. Have a good day, bro. That was a good session. I'm so glad I got that kickflip 50-50. The rail was super jankety. It kept popping off when I got to the end, but I finally stuck it and it felt good. This whole session felt good. And I've had a lot of fun this week making this video. All the spots were just super clear. No pedestrians, no one getting in the way. 
I only got kicked out one time and I had a ton of fun doing it. This pandemic is kind of paving a way for skateboarders, giving them a lot of space to skate street spots that they normally might not be able to skate. So yeah, that's it for me today. I will see you guys in the next video. I make videos every Saturday, so make sure you hit subscribe and I'll see you guys next week. Peace.